All right, folks, I done think I walked up on a cool piece of greenstone. Yeah, man. I just hope it's all there. Oh, we got a bit. Looking like a pretty good silt. I think a bit yeah. does have some damage on it, but. Does it don't have much? No, it's, it's all there. It's cool shaped. Look at that cupped bit on it. It'll clean up nicely. All right. Well, that's made it worth my trip. I'll keep looking. I don't know what this is, but it looks. Looks like a worked piece of plant. I can't tell which is which. Looks like it's got two or three notches. Maybe it's be a faker. No, that's the back end. Looks like a dovetail. But it's awful loose. It's gonna be broke. No, it's gonna be blunted. Mm -hmm. Extremely blunt. <laughs> That's just a flake that they've nibbled an edge on, but it looks like it's got a dovetail base. If, if so, that's the first dovetail blunt I've ever found. That is so cool. And flatter than a board. And translucent. It's got a little worked edge right there. Well, that's cool as can be. Awesome. I didn't flip this out, but I laid it back over. When you see it, then if I'm gonna have to make a video, I gotta give you something to watch. That's about cool. drill like dart I don't know if he's using it for a dart or if he's using it for a drill probably a drill I like it I'll keep on searching have you seen it walked up on that little jewel Take it. That's a cool little piece. I'll keep looking. I don't know how long I'll stay. As long as I'm finding stuff, got plenty of field to walk. I may stay all day. Maybe won't nobody come looking for me. This one must have just freshly washed out. Leave it. Nobody found that one if it wasn't. Well, I walked up on this drill. <clears throat> Appears to be complete. Probably was longer at one time. I'll keep on looking. I don't know how much longer I'm going to look. I'm about to be done, I think. Curly flake. Well, I'm back. Had a good day today. There's a tool. And a tool. And this is a core. percussion flakes and then real real fine edge work on it straight as can be so that was a big old knife blade 
The reason I say it's an half blade is because it's got the percussion scars. Then it's got the edge work too, showing sharpening. That was that was an awesome would have been an awesome piece right there. Here's a polished piece of greenstone, and I don't know what it is. It's got damage right there, and then it's broke. That is so slick. If anybody's got any ideas or any thoughts on that, what it could have been, I'm open to suggestions. But that's a no doubt it was an artifact. This is too too polished to even be a creek rock. There's another little scraper-like tool. Been on several hafted scrapers today. Thumb nail scrapers. Things like that. A lot of the stuff's got real nice colors in it. Size blunt. These are broken projectile points. Stem deals and notched ones. And this one's a real cool one right here. If had more sun, you could see through that. It's real nice. Anyway, it's nice in color. I told you I had several of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's super cool right there. That's my Uniface Flake Dovetail Blunt Scraper. I didn't do just uh, extremely well on points today. That one's pretty because of the color. Pinky and blue boards got base damage, but I wanted you to see that. Beautiful color. Now the points were a little bit... Uh, crude, if you will. I mean, I'm proud to find them. But I've had better days, point-wise. But it's not every day that you find a sale. i found thousands of points. But I've only... i found less than a dozen sales, though. I believe that's fresh right there. Um, it really doesn't have a lot of different color about it. Maybe it does. But more than anything, it's, it's knife-like. It's sharp. And if that had been old, it would probably been worn slick. Anyway, it wasn't just an extremely perfect point, but I hate when any of them is broken. And a little drill. Paint bird. It's beautiful colors. I love it. Like I mentioned, I'm, when you ain't found but about a dozen silts, hardstone thrills me. I like the points actually better than I do hardstone, but I'll never turn down a piece of hardstone because I just don't find that many. I believe that's a drill. But anyway, see, I didn't do I didn't do bad on points. I just I mean, I found several of them, but just nothing just over the top. I found several blunts. Of course, I've got a bucket full of ropes that I didn't bring home or didn't show you. And here's the sail. It's really unique. It's got a lot of 
modern scars on it. You see everywhere that's real light blue? Those are nicks from plow. Of course, that's old. Got all these little scratches. This side over here is got some big ones. I'm proud to get it out of the ground before it suffered any more damage. Of course, all of that on the end is just use wire. That's not damaged from the plow. You can see how unique it is in shape. It's, it's got a wild shape. It's got, it's got a flat spot right there, and then it tapers down right there to a, kind of like a bowl in the, in the middle. Of course, you can see that happening on the bit end, too, but then, then this tapers back down right here, starting down. It's a real unique shape. It's over... Well, it's about three inches wide and probably about four and a half. That's a real cool piece, though. I've never found one quite shaped like that. There's something to that, that, that cup-like bit. I know, uh, I believe it was Paleo Man 52 mentioned something about the ones he finds. Maybe it made the difference between his silts and his ads, I don't know, but... Anyway, I know it's first and I own like that. Sure is a cool piece. I was proud to find it. Display it proudly. I appreciate y'all watching.